Welcome back to CapCut video editing tutorials. In this video, we will explore different text animations in CapCut. The first one is the video in text effect. It looks very interesting, but it's actually really easy to make. And this is how it looks like. For the background video, I go to the website called pexels.com where I download a Creative Commons Zero landscape video. Let's say this waterfall video here. And once we downloaded it, we can import it into the app and start working on it. So we drag it into the timeline and select text. Let's say, let's write, for example, nature and change the font to some bold one so that it fits the animation. And once we chose the font, I chose this Rubik bold one. And now we adjust the length of the text so that it covers the whole length of the video on the timeline here. Then we go to the beginning of the text layer and Add a scale keyframe, scrolling here, and position keyframe. Then, depending on how long you want the animation to be, go to the end point of the text and add another two keyframes in scale and position. Now we go back to the first keyframe and select it. And we need to scale the text so big that it covers the whole screen. So probably for me, it would be like two and a half thousand percent. And then I adjust it so that the whole screen is white. Now, when we play back the video, we can see that the text gets smaller until it reaches the initial size. Now we place a plain black video and put it on the layer that is under the text. However, the video that I downloaded from the website are not plain, so I would have to freeze the fragment that is just black using the function that we learned before called freeze and delete the rest. And we also put it so that it covers the whole length of the text layer. Then we select those two layers of text and plain black video and click Alt J on the keyboard or create compound clip. And then we go to the video tab on the right and change blend mode to darken. Now we can see this text animation of the video that is inside the letters. This is our first animation, and let's see the other one. The next effect is text reveal while walking. It is frequently used in movies, TV shows, ads, etc. And for that you need a video of a person walking. You could film it yourself or download it from the Pexels website. In my case, I download it from the website. And then we import and drag it into the timeline and add text. So we write something there. And we see where the person starts walking. That is where we put the beginning of our text. And then I change the font size and the font. I'd like to make the font a bit more bold, so I choose the Rubik Bold font. Then we crop the video so that it is only visible where the person is walking. And prolongate the text layer until the end of the video. And now we compound it by using Alt J or double clicking and create compound clip here. Then we go to mask, add mask, and choose split. Then rotate the mask by 90 degrees or minus 90, like in my case, to create a vertical split effect. 
And now to the animation. Go to the beginning with the playhead and add position keyframe here. And then we slowly move throughout the text to start revealing it. Like this. And don't forget to follow the person in the clip because that's the whole point of this effect. And as you progress in adding keyframes, CapCut automatically creates new keyframes as you go on. So you don't need to do it manually. So repeat this process until the whole text is going to be visible. And now we play back the animation. But in the beginning, I should have put it, I should have hit the whole text at all. So changing it now. And this is what we've got. Of course, you can adjust the text, you can add shades and stuff. Now we're gonna do the reverse effect of the one that we did before. So instead of the text revealing, it's gonna be text disappearing as this person is walking. So to do that, we need to start doing the same things is to add text write something there choose the font to a more bold one and scale it and we need to locate the text to another direction so if before we put the text in the beginning of where the person is walking now we're gonna put it in the end so where the person is directed to like this and next we're gonna compound or click Alt G on the keyboard, trim our clip, use the mask horizontal and we need to rotate it by minus 90 degrees so it's gonna be like this and now we need to start doing the animation already from the moment when the person is walking so we need to put the playhead here where the person's face starts and at the position keyframe and then we're proceeding with the actions that we were doing before so move the playheads there and on the timeline Now we can see the result, but I need to change something here. So in the beginning, it should be fully open. And now we can see the final result. So this is how we made the reverse text revealance effect so text disappearance one and this was the tutorial on three easy yet interesting text animations and therefore introduction to motion design in CapCut 
None of these effects require the Pro version and I hope you found it useful and see you in next videos.